Welcome everyone, it's Bandit King Isaac speaking. This is another pond video. We've got a little bit of rocks here. Not a whole lot. This light post here, it's in, kind of in the middle of my yard. So we're gonna get rid of it. <clears throat> anyway, and this thing too, we're gonna get rid of that. That's Bully's old, uh, tire swing you like to jump on and play on i got him a another small tire that he can play with and this is a door that broke off that i'm just gonna break it down and <clears throat> put it in recycling here's some more rocks i got these out of the little rock garden that they left behind but anyway the uh aquascape people they uh one of them is going to come out and we're going to talk about the pond and everything because they're going to do a lot better job than i could ever do me and my wife were talking about it and we decided that we want to go with aquascape and get them to come out here and build us a pond it's just going to be us designing mostly and doing some of the labor and things like that because my father he um uh, he has a bunch of rocks over at his house that is in the way whenever he mows and everything. So we're gonna go out and get some big rocks for the pond. It's still gonna be around the same place. All the excess dirt's gonna go over there. I'm still getting the plastic and everything to recycle and the metal. Nothing's really changed except for we're hiring some people to help us out. Still might get the tractor. We don't really know yet until I talk to the guy. If he gets his own little tractor here, there's no reason for me to really get the tractor. I can just do other stuff with my hand that I was gonna use the tractor for around here. But anyways, he can do all that. And I'm talking to him tomorrow, well, the day after I make this video. I don't know if this is gonna be uploaded today or not maybe i don't know but he's gonna be here and i want to talk to him about a few different things or think about maybe a little waterfall and everything and i gotta talk to him about the fence he's got to know pretty much everything the size the dimensions i want the kind of pond we want me and my wife are talking about making a uh, pond for the snapping turtles we don't have any snapping turtles right now but just in case in the future we want to put the snapping turtles outside because we want to get a snapping turtle or two. And if we want to put them outside for a little bit to let them, you know, run around and play, we can use the pond down here. And eventually I'm going to get another pond set up. But it'll be a bit bigger. So I'm hoping that this pond isn't too bad on the expenses. But I'll let you guys know everything and I'll let you guys see how it goes and the steps maybe i don't really know i don't want to film anybody and they get mad so who knows but anyway i'll let you guys know how it all goes hopefully it all goes good and well still gonna have a fenced in back area we're thinking about just a regular fence for now to go everywhere and then put shrubs behind them behind the fence and as the shrubs get bigger we'll uh, take the fence down and put a smaller little white fence behind it just for looks that's so that the turtles can't really get out or anything also ew, bugs down here I'm wanting to plant some uh, of those vines up here. We're planting a different kind of vine up here. The vine over a big bunch of that after I clean it up a little bit more. There's still a big old hole right here. And here. And I still gotta get as much plastic out as I can, which has been a pain. But we'll see how it goes. Hopefully in about a year or so, it'll look like that though. And you won't be able to see anything that gets left behind. 
another thing that I was thinking about was this tree here. Not the dead one that's on it. I'm trying to knock that thing over. Maybe. I don't know. I, I guess I can leave it there. But I was thinking about putting the bird feeders and stuff back here. That's when the sitting area over here, we can hear and see the birds. And we can also look at the pond. Oh, almost fell over. And this, I'm still thinking about the cookout area. I don't really know yet. Uh, I also got to get rid of this big old tree here. As you can see, it's kind of dead or dying. And we won't be able to remove it once we get the pond set up. It'll be the pond will be in the way. And I'd be too afraid. Look, okay, that's rotten. So I'm gonna try to get rid of this thing before the guys come in here and start the pond. I don't know when they can start it. I'll know that tomorrow. But that's uh, everything, I believe. We also gotta get rid of these uh, plants, actually. I don't really get rid of but remove. I don't know if they're flowers or what. Kind of look like flowers. I don't really know. I don't know if they're Easter flowers or what. But we gotta dig them up and move them away because this could be all the rocks and stuff back here and the construction. I don't want them to be smushed. Look at these nasty little bugs everywhere back here. Disgusting little bugs. Anyways, that's it, guys. It's been Bandit King Isaac speaking. I love y'all. Peace.